I'm Airman Suzanne Pedro. I am an installation entry controller for the 90 SFS. From a very young age, my biological father um, had issues with law enforcement. So I saw um, police officers um, and law enforcement from a different perspective at a very young age. And um, I had the privilege to have my stepfather step into my mother and I's life. He has shaped and molded me into the woman that I am today. So from a very young age, uh, I have had an interest in law enforcement all throughout high school. I've been on ride-alongs, took uh, several law enforcement classes, and um, so I've always wanted to be a cop ever since I was a little girl, and I joined the Air Force for that reason. On Monday, June 28th, um, I was scanning IDs. Uh, this man and child came through the gate and he handed me his um, veterans benefits card and I scanned it. And it um, showed red on the DBID scanner um, for once and warrants and it said to hold at the gate until further notice. I handed um, the man's ID to my lead, um, A1C Shaw, and then we um, had the gentleman pull off to the side and we put um, star barriers around his vehicle and we found out that his um, warrants were for identity theft and interfering with child custody. We went out to the gentleman's car. Um, he immediately um, got out of his car, um, acted um, super nervous and fidgety and claimed that he got his identity stolen in Nevada. At this point that they said both of the names that he had given to us um, were popped hot for felonies, warrants, etc. Um, we weren't sure if there was any weapons in the car, so um, we were prepared for that before we went out to see him. And um, Sergeant James did all of the talking um, Shaw did the arrest and I went around and spoke to um, the child. So we switched over custody to the Laramie County Sheriff's Department and then we took the 10 year old into the gate shack to keep him more comfortable. He, w he loved learning about our job and then CPS showed up. I walked the child out to um, the car and I told him um, goodbye and then I went on about my day and to only have been in the Air Force for 10 months and to already have this experience um, makes me really excited for what my um, career in the Air Force and what my future will hold.